In this video, we're going to be talking about how to get some free card points in COD Mobile so free-to-play players can finally buy some nice-looking guns. Now, you probably saw a lot of videos where they tell you to go on a website and it's like this infinite card point generator, but obviously it's a scam. But today, we're going to be talking about some 100% legit ways of getting some free card points in COD Mobile. Now, the methods I'm going to show you has no risk of you getting banned, hacked, or getting your account deleted, and all these methods work no matter when you're watching this video. So grab your snacks and let's get started with method number one, which is by playing the tournament mode of COD Mobile. Now, in the tournament mode, there's a free spin wheel that has a total of three 310 card points that you can get for free so as you can see this wheel does have a lot of free card points but let me explain how to have a spin on this wheel now to have a spin on this wheel you need to get a total of 100 counts and after you get 100 counts the game is going to give you a token and when you have those tokens then you're good to go because you can use those tokens to have a spin on that wheel and get some free card points but at the end of the day the most important thing you need for these free card points is the 100 counts so let's talk about the process of getting these crowns because we want those free card points in order to get these crowns you need to play some tournament mode matches which are open on fridays saturday Saturdays and Sundays. And after each game in the tournament mode, you're gonna get a number of crowns, and the number of crowns you get depends on your placement. That means if you get more kills and points, you'll also get more crowns. So as you can tell, it is quite a grind to get 100 crowns for that token, but it does give you a chance of getting some free card points. And if you manage to get to the leaderboard, then you're gonna get some even more tokens and have more spins on that wheel. So yeah, the spin wheel in the tournament mode is a solid way of getting some free card points. Moving on to the next way of getting some free card points is by taking part on different challenges. Now, if you go to the Twitter page of COD Mobile, sometimes you can find some challenges that can get you some free COD points. For example, recently COD Mobile posted three challenges to celebrate the new year and look what they said on the caption. They said, show us that you've completed these in the replies and you might get a surprise and we later found out that that surprise is 520 COD points. And you know what? A lot of people don't even know that these kind of giveaways happen because they don't follow COD Mobile on Twitter. Like a lot of people completed these challenges and showed it to COD Mobile and they got sent 520 COD points to their mailbox for free. And it's not like these challenges are hard either. For example, one of the challenges was to get 10 kills without dying using the KS SP, which is pretty easy if you ask me. So if you want some free card points from COD Mobile themselves, then you need to stay up to date with their Twitter page and look out for new chances that they might post in the future. Okay, so the next way to get some free card points is through the COD Mobile Championship. Now, before you get scared, I'm not telling you to go to the stage and play the finals. I'm talking about the initial stages of the championship where even the average player has a chance of getting some free card points. Last year in the Snapdragon Pro Series Championship, you had a chance of getting some free card points by solo playing on stage one. And even in stage two, they give out some free card points to the top teams according to the regions. But a lot of people think that they have to be the best players in the world in order to take advantage of the championship but as you guys can see they do give out some free card points in the beginning stages as well now it is true that you have to be better than average to get these card points but hey it is another legit way of getting some free card points in card mobile now if that sounds too hard then the next way is going to be easier which is by using google opinion rewards this is an app made by google that lets you earn google play gift cards which you can use to buy card points directly from the game now the way you can earn google play gift cards from this app is by doing some surveys that the app is going to ask you every now and then and each survey from this app is going to give you around 50 cent to a dollar which is enough money to buy at least 80 card points that's right google made this app so you can help them with their surveys and for that they're going to give you some money that you can spend on the google play store to get some card points as you guys can tell it is quite a solid way to get some free card points in a legit way like this app is made by google themselves so there's no risk in using this app i'll leave the link of this app in the description so you guys can try it out for yourself and by the way i put a lot of hard work researching this video so if you're enjoying so far then make sure to leave a like anyways the next way to get some free card points is through the card mobile discord server if you guys didn't know COD Mobile has an official Discord server where you can find a lot of things, including some free COD points. Yup, that's right. COD Mobile gives out some free COD points to a handful of people in the community through this Discord server. If you go to the giveaway channel of the server, you can find a lot of COD point giveaways that COD Mobile hosted recently. And if you find any ongoing giveaways on this tab, all you gotta do is click a button and you're gonna be entered into the giveaway. And after you win a giveaway, they're gonna send the COD points directly to your game's mailbox and you can collect it from there. Now, you might think it's hard to win the giveaways, but I've seen quite a lot of people get some COD points out of this server. And the good thing is you can can make multiple entries in one giveaway. And besides card points, they also give out things like battle passes, legendary guns, and even some legendary characters. Honestly, if I had to choose between a legendary gun and a legendary character, I'd go for the legendary gun because you can actually see it when you're using it. But let me know which one would you rather choose in the comments and I'll make sure to give you a heart. But as you can tell, the Discord server of COD Mobile is a pretty solid way to get some free card points and I'll make sure to leave the link in the description so you can join this server. Moving on to the next way of getting some free card points is by using redeem codes. Now you might think redeem codes give you some trash rewards, but sometimes you can find some redeem codes that give you some card points. For example, back in 2022, you could get 2400 card points from the after pulse and respawnable redeem codes, and those redeem codes were completely free. That means you could get 2400 card points without paying a dime. But these events happen out of nowhere, so you do have to stay up to date with the community to get these redeem codes. And by the way, I make videos when these kind of redeem codes are available, so if you don't want to miss any of these redeem codes, then make sure to subscribe. The next way to get some free card points is through the COD Mobile test server. The test server is a version of COD Mobile where the developers try out 
new things before releasing it to the main game. For example, when Activision releases a new gun, they put it in the test server first and then they fix bugs and then they release it to the main game. And players who download the test server get rewards such as 10,000 COD points, some legendary guns, and even some mythic guns. It's probably one of the easiest way to get some free COD points along with some mythic and legendary guns. And I've made an entire video on how to download the test server, so if you guys are interested in downloading the test server, then make sure to click on this video. In that video, I've talked about the entire process of downloading that version of the game and again, you get 10,000 COD points for free, so yeah, it's definitely worth it. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.